Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is one that a lot of people have actually requested because I think last time I done a proper Q and A, it was quite a long time ago. Um, it's just a quick like get to know me video, um, you know, updated Q and A kind of thing because I feel like last time I done one, it's kind of a lot longer now. So I'm just gonna be answering questions I've asked Instagram to ask me. So we're gonna go ahead. Before I start this video, I just want to say thank you so much to Daffy Girls for sending me their Board in the House merch and also their t-shirt as well. It's so comfortable and you should go shop at DVG Fam Shop now. <laughs> okay, right. First off, how is school going? So I've been back to school now for two weeks and it's actually been quite good. Um, it's very, very boring, won't lie. I don't enjoy school at all, but it's just been fine. Like there's... There's nothing really bad going on. It's just very boring and there's not much to do. Um, yeah, school's been going okay, but, you know, it's not that good. What is your fave TV show? So, last time i done this, I'm pretty sure I probably said, like, Gossip Girl. But I am obsessed with Outer Banks. Like, it is a big obsession of mine right now. Um, I watch it all the time. It's literally so bad. But I'm really, really excited for the next one to come out. Okay, what is your favourite movie? Um, I actually watched After We Collided um, at the cinema the other day with my friend Tilly and I'm literally obsessed with it. It's so good. If you want to go watch it, go watch it. You'll literally love it. Um, yeah. Would you ever do merch? I really want to do merch. It's something that I've like thought about a lot and it's something I will end up doing in the future. But right now, I'm probably going to do it. I probably will do it, but just not yet. Do you think people treat you differently at school because of your followers? There's definitely a lot of people that didn't talk to me when I didn't have TikTok. Um, so, like, people do, like, say hi. And, like, a lot of the older years or the younger years, they'll be like, hi, Emily. Like, I'll say hi, I don't mind. But, yeah, it's a lot different going back because there's a lot more people that actually know me. More than before, I was kind of just like there, but like, you know, not many people actually knew me other than my year. What is your favourite subject at school? So I actually... <laughs> so I actually love PE. It's my favourite, but I don't know what happened, but my school didn't put me down for the PE GCSE. So my mum's come to them because I hate drama with a passion at this school. It's so bad. So yeah, I want to do drama... But not at my school. I want to do it somewhere else. Um, so yeah. I love PE. I love dancing. I love playing netball. Um, I just like sports really in general. Like I'm quite a sporty person. So, What GCSEs did you take? So many people have asked me this. English, math, science, computer science. Drama. And then enrichment I got art and PE. Which I was really annoyed about. So, I don't recommend. Oh and I also took geography. So yeah. Um, and also I took French, so French, Geography, Drama, Science, Maths, English and Computer Science, yeah, so that's my seven and then I got two enrichments which was PE and Art, which I hate art with a passion, I can't even do it. How's dance going? Um, I've actually left my dance school which was really sad, um, but I think it's probably for the best. I'm actually looking for a new dance school at the moment, so yeah, we'll see where this takes me. Um, but I left my old dance school, so I'm now looking for a new one. Um, I don't know where I'm going to go. I'm still looking around. But yeah, I'm just excited for a new beginning and a new start and hopefully get pushed to my full best, you know. Because I want to be a dancer when I'm older, but like on top of other things but yeah when is your birthday my birthday is 13th of august you can actually go watch my birthday vlog which will probably be up here somewhere so go watch it now <laughs> do you keep the money you earn from social media or does your mum take it my mum definitely doesn't take my money and um, that's my money i've earned it so i get to keep it but she actually puts it away for when i'm older as i don't really need the money now um yeah, like, I don't really spend that much of my money. And my parents can sit here and tell me that I do, but I don't. The past few months, I've actually not spent a lot of money. I haven't bought many clothes. Um, thankfully, PLT have been sending me them. So thank you, Shop Ami 20 for 20% off until Sunday midnight. Um, yeah, so it's been very, very 
good um, getting like scent stuff from my fave brand because I don't have to actually buy anything or I can if I want to and I still do but I just don't buy as much as I used to because I used to literally go on board buy too much <laughs> um, but yeah so most of my money goes like put away favourite thing about doing social media definitely the friends I've made from social media I've literally made my friend group um, through social media and all the opportunities I've got and I'm getting. Um, there's so many exciting stuff that I'm so, so excited to tell you guys. Um, I can't actually say much yet, but October, November, December, you will see. It's going to be so cool. I'm so excited. Um, like, literally things that I've looked up to other YouTubers and TikTokers doing, I'm now going to be doing. It's like, what? Um, but yeah, I'm so, so excited and I can't wait to share it with you guys. Um... Definitely like working with my favourite brands. If I don't feel a love in the brand, then I won't work with it. And I feel like with all the brands I've actually been given the opportunity to work with, I've literally loved. So yeah, meeting my friends, all the brand deals I've got, literally my favourite brands and the opportunities I'm actually getting. Um, since I was little, I've always wanted to do YouTube, TikTok, Instagram. Like I've always wanted to do social media. Since I was little, I've always said, oh, I want to do that. So to now be literally like living the dream at 13 years old is quite cool. <laughs> room tour. So I actually done a room tour. I'll probably be up here again. So you can go watch it because that video is kind of good. <laughs> How long have you and Grace Conda been friends for? I get so many questions about Grace. Um, I thought I'd just say that I've been friends with her for like six months now. Since the start of lockdown, we became friends. Um, and ever since, yeah, we literally text all the time or just, literally just FaceTime or something. Um, I'm so excited to see her soon. Hopefully we can see each other soon because I miss her so much. <laughs> but I love her, she's so sweet. What is your biggest fear? I actually hate rats. Like I've came to the conclusion, I can't stand rats. So if you put a rat near me, I'm probably gonna cry because they just scare me so much. Like, oh, no, sorry. I actually hate rats so much. Um, yeah, so many rats. What's your best memory with the UK youngers? Probably... Um, basically, we had this sleepover, like, all of us. And I think it was everyone other than Pearl and India, because India had to go home. Um, but, obviously, they're still involved. But <laughs> we was going to bed, and... All of the girls was literally huddled in. So, like, you had Grace and Harriet. No, it was Grace, Olivia, Lily, Harriet, and me in the middle. And I was just kind of sitting there, like, getting cuddles from every single which way. It was so good. We literally just cuddled until I fell asleep. Apparently, I fell asleep first because that's just me. I always fall asleep. But, yeah, so that was pretty my favourite memory because it was just, like, so cute. <laughs> you want a little sister or brother? I would literally love a younger sibling, but my parents said no. They don't want any more kids, but I want more kids. Oh, no, I don't want kids. My parents, I want them to have kids, but they said no. But I would love a little sister. Like, it seems so fun. Or, like, a little brother. Like, I could... are you single? No, I'm not. I'm going to keep going with these questions. What's it been like going back to school with everyone knowing about your TikTok? Um, it's definitely been different. <laughs> you get them occasionally, like, them stares. But I haven't really seen my other years. And everyone in my years kind of just, like, left me alone. <gasps> Ow. Everyone in my years kind of left me alone about it. But the people in the other years, they're like... That's the girl that has one million on TikTok, and I'm just like... <laughs> um, are you proud of everything you've achieved? Yeah, obviously, it's, like, really cool to be able to say I've lived most of my dreams at 13. So, yeah, <laughs> definitely. What's your least favourite subject? I hate drama. Like, I literally can't stand it. So, drama... What's another one I don't like? Or French. I don't know how French you are. Or maths or English or science. I literally don't like any lessons other than PE. Are you a very stressful person? I would say I'm stressful to be around, but I stress myself out. Like, I... I don't know. I'll be literally laying in bed and I'll be like, what if that person doesn't actually like me? Like, what if they just pretend to like me, but they don't actually like me? Like, I think like that all the time. So, yeah. I'm a bit of an overthinker in a way. Do you prefer POVs or dance videos? I literally like both of them. I feel like POVs are more... Like, it's harder to do because you have to think of a POV. Like, with dance videos, if it's a dance, you can just kind of learn it, you know? So. Do you go to a public or private school? I go to a public school, but I did go to a private school for a bit. Fave skincare shop. So, I think my favourite skincare shop's probably 
La Roche Posay or Mario Bonescu. Mario Bonescu actually sent me a box full of stuff the other day and it was so good, so thank you for them. And La Roche Posay has been my favourite since I was like year seven, so yeah, definitely them two skin brands. Do you wear makeup? Okay, I'm gonna end it on this note. So, like, if I'm going out to like a party or something, yeah, I will wear makeup. Girls in my year wear makeup when they go to parties and like when they go out, but right now I'm wearing nothing other than I got my eyebrows tinted the other day, so they're really dark, but they won't be this dark soon. They're just very dark at the moment, but yeah, I'm not wearing any makeup. I don't really like wearing too much makeup every day. Like, if I was to wear makeup, it would just be like concealer, eyeshadow, eyebrow stuff. You know, mascara, like the basic makeup. I wear makeup, I can't say I don't wear it, but I just don't wear it very often. And like, I'd rather not wear it as much when I take Insta pics. Like, I don't really wear it in any of my Insta pics. And TikToks, I never wear it. Um, I just feel like I don't want people to have to always wear makeup. Like, it's something that I enjoy doing. Like, I'll just put on makeup sometimes because I'm bored. But I don't wear it like all the time. Like, just sometimes. I feel like that kind of answers all the questions I got asked the most. So yeah, thank you so, so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!